Hey everybody, it's Lita with your two minute training and today I want to talk to you about GPS devices. We all know GPS devices are inside of our cars, we have them on our phones and we can even use them on Apple iPods and things like that. Now I'm an avid traveler, I go to cities all the time and I also go into the back country. There's been a big influx with people, especially millennials, going and traveling into the backcountry areas. That means that their cell phones don't necessarily work, so they're starting to invest in special GPS devices, a Spot or a DeLorean. A Spot is going to be a type of GPS device that when you're in trouble, you have to slide a lever and push a button. It sends information to a dispatch center of where your coordinates are off of satellites. And that, the dispatch center problem there, is they then locate the correct authorities and then you send help. With a spot device, you don't know what the circumstances are. You don't, you have no way to communicate with that device. You have no way to know if it's medical, if they just need a tank of gas, or if they just need more water. For a subscription fee, you can get what's called a DeLorean device. A DeLorean device lets you text back and forth between the dispatch center. I recently had one where it was a girl who had severe altitude sickness. She had been texting with her family back and forth and then all of a sudden, at the end of the night, the texting stopped. Her situation was pretty critical. People checked on her walking by her tent and they then were able to send from her device a SOS. And we had to dispatch up fire EMS, well, search and rescue and EMS, our special EMS team, and get her a helicopter in the backcountry because her symptoms had become so severe. Now, a lot of people get frustrated when they get one of these warnings from a spot device or a GPS device. They think, oh man, they hit it in error. Why am I sending somebody way out there? It doesn't matter. You have to teach, treat every alarm, every activation as if it's an actual emergency. It doesn't matter if they just need water. It doesn't matter if they need a tank of gas. It doesn't matter if they were ill prepared. You still are going to need to send help. So I hope you understand a little bit now about the different devices that are out there. This is Lita with your two minute training. Thanks for watching.